Now, there are a list of events leading up to Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Day in the city of Jackson. On 12 News, Morgan Gill spoke to community leaders about this year's celebration. Councilman Kenneth Stokes of Ward 3 says this will be the largest celebration in history. Starting on Thursday, January 11th at 6 p.m., there will be an awards banquet at Jackson State University in ballrooms A and B in the Campus Union, honoring people such as the Man and Woman of the Year with many awards for different categories. The Attorney of the Year, the Doctor of the Year, we have awards, the Preacher of the Year, we have awards in so many different categories. After thirds, we had two people going to receive an award. We will have an award in honor of my wife, Judge Loretta Cooper Stokes. On Friday, there will be a talent show at Lanier High School in the auditorium beginning at 6 p.m. James Hopkins, CEO of Reset Jackson, tells us he will be leading Saturday's parade beginning at Freedom Corner, ending at Lanier High School. The parade begins at 10 a.m. I just want people to leave after this parade, just knowing that, you know, we can get together, we can do positive things, you know, without the uh, angry outbursts and gunshots and, and just kind of get a feel of what Dr. King went through before he was assassinated and then understand why he was assassinated. On Sunday, there will be a Stop the Violence March beginning on Freedom Corner, ending at the Medgar Evers Library. This starts at 2 p.m. So, um, like, once again, people always talking about they ain't got nothing to do. Come out and get to know your neighbors. Get to know the people you deal with in the community. Be a part of this celebration. On January 15th, there will be a laying of the wreath at Freedom Corner at 10 a.m. with the birthday bash following at Jackson City Hall at 12 noon. Morgan Gill, 12 News.